Hello everyone, this is Robert here bringing you Final Fantasy XIV. I get to talk to my favorite, f favorite friend, uh, Dipstick. His name is Dipstick, now and forever. Aww, you want to go back on the keyboard? Well, I need you to go. Uh-uh. I, 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 why are you selling Gil? You can earn it so fast. You know what? Just report this guy. Random money tricks. I agree. There we go. Don't have to deal with him. Please, just stop selling money when it's so easy to get. I don't know. Like, you you have a better time. Oops, sorry, Emil. But I can't have you on the keyboard. Can you go up here? Can you go up here? No? Okay. On the shoulder. <laughs> All right, we can hold. I can hold you like this for a while, sure. It's not like I got something to do. Oh, now you want me to let go? <laughs> Birds. Um. I don't. I just. Why are you selling me gold that I don't need? I'm earning so much money. Where to go? Where to go? Where, there we go. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm almost at a hundred thousand gil. I'm pretty certain by the time my 30 days are up, I could easily get a million if I was trying. But I'm not, so who cares? But woo! Oh, look at that. Actually, that's not bad water supply. <laughs> okay. Okay. Listen, I'm going to I'm going to ask you this kindly. So please look into my eyes. Could you, you know. Make like a nail and get to the freaking point. Shut up, you. I'm not talking to you. All right, let's do this. Brother Isumi requires your assistance. Oh, glasses. Item comparison. I'm just looking at them all to see what the difference is. And what I need. What's what's the item I need? Um, Acolyte boots, 15, 26. Uh, gloves? 21. I'm just going to upgrade my lowest level item. Uh, let's see. 15. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to upgrade the, um, the robe. Item comparison again? Yeah, I, I, I meant try on. Oh, yeah. This just screams doctor. Let's do it. Welcome, Fearn. The tales of your deeds have the tales of your deeds reach even me here in the cloister heart of the cloistered heart of the steel glade fang. Oh joy, just just what I needed. The son of Satan to praise me. Glad I am that you have come. Yes, Yoda. Me, I'm too glad that I have come, for I would ask your assistance in a matter of some delicacy. Ah, oh, dang it. Dang it. I was trying to show you that Emil's like looking at the cat tail and he's just like, what's this? And just trying to trying to catch it. Oh, you're a little darling. Glad I am that you have come for I would ask you for I would uh, for I would ask your assistance in a matter of some delicacy. It concerns yes, young Sylphie once again. As you can no doubt imagine. The recent revelations concerning her mother have solely troubled the poor child. It appears Sylphie needed some time alone to sort through the whirlwind of emotions which now beset her. She has, in short, fled from the guild. Gee, I wonder who the cause of that one is. I, I can't tell, but I think the pr I think the person responsible for that complete travesty is wearing a black robe and has white uh, platinum blonde hair and freaking doesn't blink oh never mind he just blank he just blunk he blunked he blunked it fortunately a party of conjurers who were dispatched to the south shroud to investigate another instance of corruption sent word that they have spotted our way our wayward sylphie Considering the importance of their mission, I would not seek to distract the conjurer from your task. Thus, I turn to you to escort Sylphie back here to the guild. You are, I believe, one of the few people to whom she will listen. So let me get this straight: you don't want to, you don't want to interrupt any conjurers. 
you don't want to interrupt any conjurers from doing their work. Yet, I'm the one. Do you? Do you do, I think I see a problem with your logic, because I am a conjurer, you dipstick. Pray travel to Buscarin's Duther and speak with Wolfie, Wolfooing or uh, Wolfie. She's kind. Of, she's a furry. She's a furry. I'm going to assume that she's a furry or he. Don't judge. She was the conjurer who first chain chanced upon Sylvie, and will be able to tell you more of how the young lady fares. Mm hmm. Oh my God. I'm. I'm physically speechless. You didn't drag me for two hours talking to about absolutely jack squat. You're still dipstick, but I'm proud of you. Okay, so now let's just, uh... Ah, oh, crap. Wolfie. So where's the nearest one? I think that's here. And we'll go say hi and be the hero the world needs. At least I'll get a. At least I'll get. A, at least I'll get. You know, a robe, a swanky robe, I suppose. Not really swanky. It suits me. Come on. You know, you don't need to see the loading. And we're back. Ooh. The heck? That's not even a mouth. Oh, it has wings. Okay. Sure. What's up? Not bad, but I got I gotta save some, you know, person or something. I'm not too sure, but I'm here for her. Because I'm forced to. Ah, I love that. You're the hero of the world. Just for once I would like one MMO to have like choices and one of them's like, I don't want to be the hero. I want to sit down and drink. <laughs> oh well. But hey, she's next to a porter. Okay, let's go. Come on. Oh my god. Why me? Why? Marco Polo? Oh, I'll, I'll believe him. That's a good guild name. Hey, buddy. Again, and there's the wings. Okay. Ah, oh, there you are. Well. Sure. Oh, how should I do her voice? Ah, we meet again, Fearin. I assume Brother Isumi warned you of the corruption, my companions, and I have been tasked with purifying here in the South Shroud? No. The source of this extensive blight is found to the southeast. The shrill, discordant voices of the elemental shriek their dismay in the vicinity of the withered tree, and I suggest you give the area a wide berth. Uh-huh. Considering the potential danger, you might imagine how alarmed I was to discover young Sylvie wandering around this part of the Twelve Woods. It seems that her mother, a woman who healed with conjury but remained untrained by the guild, called this region her home. I don't see how this is relevant, but okay. Sylvie herself had had, had her head buried in some manner of tome, but if she is as sensitive to the elemental's murmurings as I am led to believe, then the din within her mind must be driving her to distraction. Wow, could you just like tell me where she is? I mean, I don't need the entire, I don't need her entire life story. I just need her, I just need to know where she is at the moment. Pray speak with the child and see that she is well. I would do so myself if our current duty were not so pressing. We will in fact be setting out at any moment. That's great. I don't know why you had to give me your entire backstory, but sure. Let's just let's just go. Mm -hmm. Come on, Braveheart. Hey Sylphie. Listen, it's your um Uncle Fear. Yeah, that's right, Uncle Fear. Oh god. This is gonna be one of those. How come you get leaves and I don't? <laughs> Fearin? Ah, I should have known that Wolfie would send I knew I should have known that Wolfie would tattle on me. And Brother Isumi sent you to take me back, didn't he? Yeah? This is where my mother used to live, you know. Right up until she passed on. Folks were grateful for the healing she offered. Uh-huh. And this is the journal she used to keep. There's an, there's an entry in. Explain how she, nature becomes furious when conjurers use their all arts. How there are always more people wounded in battles when mortals abuse the power that is not theirs to take. Okay. 
My mother refused to draw on nature because she was scared of making it angry. Alright. Uh-huh. She wouldn't lie about such things, and I want to do what she would have wanted. I'm going to stop using conjury altogether. Okay. Is 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 that the lesson for the day? Am I am I free to go? <clears throat> I never I've never heard the voices this mad before. Okay, calm down. I bet it's because Wolfie and the others are overusing their arts. We have to go and stop them. My character's just like... Ugh. Listen, bird, I I'm just gonna give you a little pet because I need... <laughs> yes, you too, Emil. Oh. <laughs> there we go. I pet my little burby. Come on, Emil. There you go. You get a pet too. Oh yeah. Alright, let's go. It's kind of hard to not pet the bird. Oh, come here. I, I need, I, I need to, uh, we need, we need to do this together, man. Catch you on the flip side. And we're back. Uh, something's not happening. She is very, she has a very big headache. God, it's so loud. Can't you hear it? Nature is shrieking in rage. Oh, so am I. Do you know I, do you know because of you, I had to talk to Dipstick? That, that's infuriating. Yeah, sure, we'll proceed. Uh-huh, and... Purify the corrupted earth. Alright. So how do I purify? Um, I guess I attack it. That's pretty much what I'm going to do. Sister Wolfie, I, I could let you down, but... I, I gotta keep you uh, alive. My my, I'm assuming they would look, they would frown upon me, and not pay me, and that's just not something I would like to do. Boom. All right. So what now? Even the creature of the woods know this is wrong. Come on, we're just brother Noel. Now nature sends thunder and lightning against us. What more proof do you need? Um, I need you to calm down and help us. This is just this is just stupid. There you go. Look at that. Hey, um, brother Noel, I I, I thank you. Okay, you see, there's this there's the um there's this like area of effect that you see. It's called the don't go zone, or the GTF zone. I'm going to need you to do that. Seriously? What the heck? Elementals, are they angry too now? We're really in trouble. No, they're, they're, they're calm. Guys, you don't need to be stupid. You could just, you could actually do your job. I, what are you doing? I, Jesus. Why? That's it. I'm just attacking the tainted earth. You guys can die. I don't know why. I don't know why you think this is... I don't know why. Just pick the dang target we need to attack. That's all you need to do. It's like your NPCs. And... Boom. Done. See? My god. The elementals are they angry too? The elementals are helping us? Yes, see, this is why you should just just listen to me. I I can't actually I, I can't believe nature actually helped us. There was nothing scary about it at all. I might still wonder if it was really if it really was safe for conjurers to borrow the power if I hadn't seen the way that you willed it. Nothing could seem more natural. What the hell are you ooh. Ah, uh, nothing like to have a level 50 mob near you. I'm not going to touch that. More natural. I think it's time I went back to the guild. There are a few things I need to collect first, so please go on ahead without me. Oh my god. This is, this is, this is the nicest thing anyone has ever done to me. They got to the point! No more dragging it out. No more overzealous... 
talks about nature. Just the point there. Oh, sorry. The point there. And we're done. Oh my god, I'm so happy! <laughs> and I get to talk to him again, which will make me undoubtedly more sad, but I'm going to relish my one, my one iota of happiness. This, this is, I deserve this. Um, yeah, I don't care about you. I don't care about that quest. I, I've done it. I'm done. I've succeeded. I'm an adventurer. Hey, get away. I'm not going to fall down. I'm an adventurer. I'm a big boy now. I, I know what I'm doing. But seriously, though, let me use mounts in the city. Hey, Emil. You do. What you doing? You, you, what you doing? All right, what are you planning on doing? He's looking at me like, uh, I'm not doing anything bad. You, you're doing something bad, aren't you? Yeah, you are. I see you. Look at that. They're going to see. See? That's him. That's what he does. He just sits on the can. He just sits on the... Sits on the hot bar. <laughs> he knows I'm talking about him. Is that right? Is that right? Are you going Are you going to press buttons? Yeah? You are? What you planning? What you thinking? Alright, brother Isumi. Welcome back, Fearin. Oh, wait. Welcome back, Fearin, and uh, you all. Wait. Welcome back, Fearin! And also you, Sylphie. <laughs> yeah, that's the respect everyone gets from him. Brother Isumi, I'm. Oh, wait. Brother Isumi, I'm sorry I ran away like that. I'm not. I understand, child. Do you find the, did you find the answers you sought? Yes, thanks to fear, and he showed me that nature was nothing to be afraid of. What you're? <laughs> you weren't afraid of nature, apparently. You were upset that we were abusing their power, and now you're afraid. I. Which is it? Which is it? I think I know why my mother refused to call upon its power. She believed the act caused suffering to nature itself. I see. Oh, I see. So it was ver so it was her very love for nature that prevented her from drawing on its strength. Tell me, Sylphie, has the fog of indecision now lifted from your mind? It has, Guildmaster. I understand now why my mother chose the path she did. And dear God, your eyes. You know what? That's a perfect camera angle because their eyes are not like zoomed up. Hold on. There we go. Just to make sure that it comes back. Their eyes are not like zoomed in and they're not like going. And they're not like this. Those were lovely camera angles. <laughs> Full glad I am to hear that. For I must ask you of for I must ask of you one more question. Does this make me look fat? Yes, brother Isumi. When you first witnessed fear and cleanse the corrupted element, you mentioned hearing voices. How did they exactly sound? I could tell you how they exactly sound. They sound kinda of like this. Oh my god! Help me! Don't beat the glover loving crap out of me! Just cure me! God why? Pretty much that's what I heard. The voices? Well, they sounded joyful, like a crowd letting out a sudden cheer. I really heard them, I swear. I'm sure you did, Sylphie. This is a gift. And oh my god, we're back to the close-up camera angles of, you know, soulless here. Dipstick. Conjurers may sense the power of nature and borrow from its strength, but not all can hear its whispers. It's kind of like a bad, bad internet connection. What you described are the voices of the elementals. You may very well possess the talent to become a hearer. A hearer? Yes, dumbass. <laughs> of course, much relies on your studies of conjury. You have a natural aptitude, but have thus far lacked commitment. You must not neglect your training, Sylphie, or else I'll be there to torment you. Yeah, is that it? Are we done? Oh my god! Putting this... Putting aside such manners for a moment, I'm curious to hear about the disturbance you observed in the South Shroud, Fearin. I assume from the reports I have received that it was a different magnitude to those which you had previously encountered. Am I correct? Hmm. I didn't even say anything. He just immediately went on to the next part. 
Hmm, this bodes ill. The creature, the creatures known as mud pies are not native to the Twelve Woods. I wonder what relations this may have to the seemingly ever-increasing frequency of these disturbances. I don't know. Some, something beyond the damage wrought by the calamity afflicts the Twelve Woods. I shall commune with the elementals to see and seek to identify the threat. This threat. Okay. You should just do that to the start. Fear and Sil fear and Silphy, I may have need of both. I may have need of you both before long. Until then, give yourselves over to the study of our arts. I'd rather just hang myself if I ever have to talk to you again. Oh my God, my character, my character's literally looking at him like, please. His thought process. Please, let us in. I can't stand it anymore. Every time this guy talks, I feel my hours drifting by. My life, my soul, my entire youth gone, wasted. Everything this guy talks, I just want to run. Run far and just die in peace. But I will never have that chance, will I? That's pretty much what he's thinking. Ever shall the earth meet your footfall and the wind guide your path yeah whatever i'm out okay let's see uh let's um that's 15 just checking up on all the um which gear is lowest level that's uh definitely not lowest level yeah sure this gives me and i'll look swanky give me my new shirt i'll miss I'll miss being a pirate. And I did it. I leveled. I am the best. There is no one that can beat me. And dear God, I hate the armor chest, armory chest. I get why it's there. And then... Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is the look of a hero. Hold on. There we go. That's perfect. We're gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it doing like this. <laughs> Have fun and keep playing, y'all. Until next time. You wanna say bye to them too? Come on, Emil. Come on. There you go. Oops. Sorry. You wanna say bye? Bye.